Let's jump to the war here, and today we've got a saving a disaster battle that is absolutely massive. Playing it, the Seducers of Slanesh are going up against Reichland, and they are bringing nearly four full stacks to bear. There's three units short of it, and they've got a lot of really good units in here, including a very beefed up Karl Franz. Now, it is on normal unit scale, which I normally reject. I prefer it to be on large or ultra unit scale. I just think the battles are more interesting. However, because this battle has just so much going on, and because it is such a massive challenge, I've made an exception here, because not very often do I encounter a decisive defeat in order resolve where I actually believe it is possible to win. But there is a lot of things that we have to manage here, because our army is an absolute dog's breakfast. You know, we got mixed match units all over the place, no rhyme or rhythm to it, it's just smashed it all together. We got garbage here, we got a reinforcing army that's got a lot of random crap all over it, and same thing over here, but although that is a... Um, a devotee army so I don't expect him to have made any sort of uniformity with that so the first thing that we got to do is decide firstly on the banners that's the easiest thing that's got the banners are all wrong there we want the speed banner on Nakari and the chart the other banners don't really matter just put them wherever doesn't matter no, I put on something that's actually gonna whatever wait that's probably already got fear doesn't it yeah because they're demons so put on that maybe that's a demon that's not a demon. Okay, put it on I mean, that one. Okay, that's not overly important. Then we have to decide about which units to seduce. So, uh, when deciding on seducing, it's not a good idea to just be like, Oh, pick its strongest unit. This, is, this unit here is not a threat to us at all. Not really. So what we need to do is take away the units that are a serious threat, and also take into consideration try the units that are cost efficient. So, Pistoliers, for example, that's a pretty good unit. I'm going to steal that away from them because they can do a lot with that, given that we have no missile units and we're fairly quick and vulnerable to non-armor piercing missiles. So we're going to steal that and it's cheap. Then I want to take away two gunners, uh, a little bit short on that, so I can only take one gunner. It's important to take units away from the first army, but absolutely not essential. So let's have a look in the second army. There's some crossbows, some of those. I can't take that one. You know, if you're thinking, why not take the artillery? I don't want to take artillery because I don't want to try to compete with them with something that they are always going to have superiority on. We could steal a Hillstorm rocket battery from them from the start, but that won't win us the battle, especially because I can take out that Hillstorm rocket battery very easily. And by extension, they can take out my Hillstorm rocket battery easily. Whereas this one here, that's going to be a little bit more annoying to deal with, which is why I won't take it away. Okay, I'm going to take a crossbow. So I'll seduce them. And then we also want to not control large army. There is a lot of things that we need to do in this battle. Let's jump in and see what we can do. Because even after we made the seduction, it still says decisive defeat. It's on very hard battles with uh, maximum AI cheats. So that means just taking our army and smashing it into theirs is a guaranteed failure, no matter how good your micro is. Because you're just not going to break these guys unless you put in the hard work beforehand. What we need to have is like a... A stu not stuffing around phage, a, a, like a um, kind of skirmish, except we don't have any missile units. Well, we do have missile units now. Now, there are some reinforcements that I want to bring in from this army here. I want to bring in, at the very least, that Keeper of Secrets. And I'd also like to bring in the Cultist. So what I need to do is make sure that it comes in first. So I'll put that one away to 5 minutes 40 second, 46 seconds. So that one is prioritized to come in first. Now, because the Garrison came in as well, which is very annoying, because it's actually a settlement battle, um, you know, unwalled settlement battle, which we don't have an option for withdrawal, which means certain units, in order to bring in our reinforcements, certain units have to get wiped out. Now, I'm going to need a lot of control groups in this battle here, so let's get started with that. So, control group one and control group two. Then I want speed, so I'm going to put these into control group three, and I think I'll hide them to begin with. Karl Franz's army is going to come in first. It's likely going to be the first four units, which is not a big threat to me. Okay, then after that, this one here be... Actually, no, this should have its own control group because it's a different unit type. Uh, control group 5 for that. Then the melee infantry I want to keep. Control group 6. The melee infantry I don't want to keep. Actually, no, no, these ones here, control group 7. I do want to keep them. Somewhat. And then all of this here be control group 8, and this will be sacrificed at the beginning so that I can bring in my desired reinforcements. So if I get rid of all the garrison, that wasn't part of my initial number. So I've got 23 units in my army, which means if I get rid of four units from it, withdrawn or wiped out, 
then only one of them will come in. Uh, I could sacrifice an Exalted Demon in. I don't think that's a good choice. I could sacrifice a unit of Chaos Warriors. Let's just, uh, let's just see how things play out. I, if I'm going to sacrifice anything, let's sacrifice the Pistoliers. But let's play it by ear. Alright, we've got a decent amount of wins. Good. Alright, let's get going. Okay, go, go. So what I want to do to begin with is use Nakari's abilities to thin them out a little bit. I don't actually want any of their units to leave the battlefield, with the exception of, like, artillery. What the hell? I told you to move up that way. Now, with the speed banner, we are probably faster than Karl Franz. I want to draw Karl Franz away and fight him in melee. If possible, I'll draw him over to here. Actually, why don't we get you out? See if you can draw Karl Franz out. Okay, nice of you to do that. I'll take advantage of that. Very stupid. And what we want to be doing to begin with is use Nakari to snipe single entities out of the way as much as possible. So Karl Franz will be coming in soon, and that's fine. If they want to keep doing this, that is fine by me. You could use slicing shards as well, but they will move out of the way because it's on this difficulty. Now, Nakari should be able to heal using Advanced Soul Siphon. Yep. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Is that the one that heals him? Which is the one that heals him? It should be in here. It's, it's hard to see when it's... Actually, if I go like this, I'll be able to spot it. Uh, Harvester of Souls, that's what we're looking for. Yeah, he's got it. You'd have to be a fool to be this high rank and not get that. Okay, the cannons are starting to shoot at us. That is not ideal. Carl Franz is coming. I still think that single entities are more powerful on small unit scales than they are in Ultra. Because look how quickly we took out that Great Cannon. That wouldn't have happened on Ultra. Okay. Do this one over here. I didn't want to take any of that. Don't forget, they're on the attack as well. So they're going to have to make a maneuver. But because they've got artillery superiority, they're going to try to make use of it. I'm not worried about the Hillstorm Rocker batteries. Alright, send these in a bit more. A bit closer. Now, in order for Nakari to heal, he has to wipe out a full unit. It's a lot easier to do that with single entities. We'll see. It's really good that he's so quick. Okay, looks like we've got Carl Francis' attention. Move back a little bit. Okay, now just throw these away. Just throw them straight into there. It's fine. Alright, looks like we got Carl Francis' attention. Move around. That's it, come at me, bro. Alright, use the pistol is. Let's draw him away. Mm, it's not really working. He didn't really take the bait that well. This move quick and maybe try to just hang on. Let's see, move back a bit there. Because, yeah, in a straight up duel, I, it could go either way with Carl Franz because it is on very hard battle difficulty. So, let me just see what else I could do in the meantime. I think the guns are pretty valuable to them. Let's try and take them out. These guys here, I totally expected them to get wiped out. Well, it's a route. That's what I was hoping for. No one faster. Obviously, we want to do as much damage as we can first. Okay. Alright, that's it, that's it, that's it. Come on, Carl friends. Come on. Come at me, bro. There's also these guys here. It's not ideal. Alright, let's bring out Control Group 3 as well. They'll be able to outrun them anyway. Lure Carl Franz as much as possible out this way. The fact that Carl Franz is refusing to get away from his army is actually really kind of smart of them. Not what I expected. Probably because they've got artillery. If I maybe get rid of it, they'll stop doing that. 
Because, yeah, these bullets aren't really doing anything. I, I wasn't expecting them to. This Carl Franz is on Force March, so he's tired already. All these fast units here really disable me from getting in there and getting into sort of like cycle charging. Okay, come on, let's see if we can get him out of here. What I need to do is pin him down with a bunch of like lower tier units. So how about you come in here, pin him down. And then we have Nakari hit him in the ass. Come on, get over here. So the Bouncer Power must be in our favor to begin with. Alright. Now we just gotta wait for our reinforcements to come in, because we gotta wait for everyone to leave the battlefield there. Yes. Right, Carl Franz, what are you doing? Whips. We cannot refuse. Oh, damn it, he doesn't want to come down and fight now. <laughs> okay, I gotta take out these Hellstorm rocket batteries, because I think they're just... No, actually, the defensive position probably works well for us. If I could just... Okay, maybe if I could get this one to come back over here, shoot him a bit, he might land. Because, yeah, their tactics will change as soon as they lose their artillery. Let's try to dodge those artillery in the meantime. So everything I can to try to take out Carl Fran. He's the most dangerous unit, so extreme caution is needed here. Because, yeah, he could kill us very quickly on this unit scale. Come on, get over there, try to shoot him. He's just not taking the bait. Alright, just get back, he's not taking the bait. Okay, now he's taking the bait again. <laughs> God damn it. Come on. What the hell is that? You won't even within range. Over here, I gotta draw him away from his guns. We don't want to be getting shot at while we're fighting in melee. Yeah, look at his weapon strength. Absolutely bloody huge. You know, for this unit scale, that's essentially like over a thousand on Ultra. So yeah, he can kill us real bloody quick. Okay. Unfortunately, he doesn't land properly. There, there, there. Okay, here we go. Here's our chance. Gotta kill him quick. Try to hit him in the ass wherever possible. That's why it's really good to pin him down with shit units. So if he's fighting just like a unit of regular cavalry. Good, we've now got a gate of Slaanesh ready. He hasn't done any damage, I think, to Nakari. Come on, move, 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 move. We've got to be hitting that. Ah, yes. Cycle charge him. But yeah, while he's pinned down here, he's... Move that back. Okay, this fight's going really well so far. Who cares if he takes out this unit? Okay, this one came in. Good, good, good. All right, you're now... Oh, I need a control group for you. Control group... I don't know. Four. <laughs> I don't know. I'll have, to, I'll have to rejig it all. Just, just stay out of it for now. Okay, Carl Franz did actually do a fair bit of damage to Nakari. Okay, let's do that again. But we can heal. We can heal. Come on, Nakari, get in there. And he's unbreakable. Come on, man. These spells don't last for very long. I need you to really hit him. Okay, he's turned around. Need to turn around ourselves because oh my god, single hit just does so much damage. Okay, this could be good to lower his melee attack just a bit, even if it prevents him from getting one attack in. Come on, get him. Get him. Go, one more hit. He's one hit point. Come on, one hit point. There we go. We got him. All right, that's good. Now I need to rejig my uh, my units a little bit. All right, did we get soul siphoned? Good. So we're getting a little bit of healing. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, I need you to actually be in control group one, I suppose. It's the same kind of unit type. All right, there's still a few single entities left. They're just bringing in melee infantry. That's fine. Alright, those Hillstorm rocket batteries are not a threat. What are a threat are the handgunners. So that's why we need to use Lash of Slanesh. They constantly keep reforming. 
because they're not sure what to do. I was counting on that. I doubt we're going to be able to get this guy to land easily, but these two over here shouldn't be too difficult to kill. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. I wasn't expecting it. Hang on. This should be nowhere near as difficult as Carl Franz. Don't let it get back up. That's it. This is a dangerous unit taken out, but nowhere near as dangerous as Carl Franz, so that's good for us. Alright, good start so far. Yep, they just bring another piece of trash. Alright, this guy here, that's an important unit to take out, but not among those halberdiers. Nordler Marines. Good, good, good. Draw them away. Those are a little bit of an issue, but I'll bring these back in to try to deal with them, because they're not the anti-large variant. Oh, no, they are. <laughs> no, they are the anti-large variant. Okay. I desire new surroundings. What do you want? So just need to give him enough bait to keep coming at us. Hang on, no, come at us, bro. No, don't push him. Pin him down. Your desires are mine. No one faster. That's it. Okay, stay away from those halberds. Move, 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 move. Flay their minds. Feast of And this is why we needed to have so much speed on Nakari. He just runs circles around them. Alright, chill over there. Alright, let's bring you in now, and I'm gonna summon a unit on top of them, especially on the guns. I'm not too worried about the Hellstorm rocket battery is good. Okay, another single entity dead. That's it. We just need to be keeping on taking out these single entities. Because our army, like our uh, actual proper units, are not going to be able to deal with them. So we have our single entities deal with them first. Okay. Nikari's magic is needed. And also more healing for him every time we kill a single entity. So that's good. Put that down on them. Alright, these ones here. I don't want Nikari fighting them. Yeah, those guns are a problem. You're nowhere near as quick as Nakari. Half the level speed. Okay, hang on. Get back, get back. Alright, maybe maybe I should... Hang on, hang on. 97 speed compared to 75. Okay, let's get ready to pop that summon on the handgunners over here, since they were causing a lot of problems for Nakari. These guys won't shoot at us because we're playing on very high battle difficulty. Okay, we're... We've already used up a fair bit of our magic. Get you out of there. I can summon the keeper. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't want to do that. Move, move, move. I do want to kill this one, so let's lure it out over here. How those demonets doing? Yeah, keep going for those handgunners. Right, you in there? Okay, we can't stay here for long because of those damn halberd is halberd uh, demigriff knights. That is. Okay, the artillery has pretty much just about been spent. Just about. Right, now I'm gonna get rid of these damn demigriff knights. I can't bring my cavalry close because they just get shot by their artillery. Maybe if Nakari kind of does hit and runs, that might work. Because, yeah, I need my cavalry for later on in the battle. Okay, hit and runs. Move, 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 move. Hopefully we don't get hit. Got hit a little bit. Don't get stun locked. Come on, move. Okay. It's good to see their gunners are really low in morale. We've almost got rid of them. Just one more to deal with. And it's in a nice big blob there, so that's good. Oh, there's more Demigriff Knights with Halberds. Great. It's good to see the K 
cannoneers. Okay, that's shattered, that's good. Cannoneers are not on their artillery anymore. That is good for us. Here. So Nakari's done a ton of damage so far, but we're almost out of magic. I think that guy there is the actual commander of the battle. I'm not entirely sure. Actually, I can check. Yeah, we haven't killed the enemy general yet. The actual commander of the battle. Don't worry about that. Now, I won't be able to withdraw this guy once he's used up all of his health, and I don't think we've got any mo way of keel uh, healing him. Keep doing this and just thin out those units. Like I said, if I use slicing shards, it's just going to, um, they're just going to dodge it. They keep blobbing up for this, which is nice. Alright, I've only got two more casts of that until we're out. Alright, let's start bringing these ones around over here. And this one, I need to get rid of these damn halberdiers. Ah, I keep going halberdiers. They demigriff nice with halberds. I would like this one to charge this a bit more, but because you don't have the fights last as long in a normal unit scale, it's going to be difficult for them to fight something weak enough to, for two minutes. Especially if you don't have any healing, which we don't have. Right. One more cast remains. Watch out for those guns. Let's get around over here. You Actually, you. Keep luring it over here, and I'll bring the guns out to get rid of that. That actually should work out pretty well for us. No one faster. So Nakari can't heal that much more. So with these guys here, there should be enough armor-piercing anti-large. There's no anti-large, but there's enough armor-piercing, I think, to deal with the Demogriff Knights. But what we want is a many-to-one fight. Okay, don't stand prolonged combat. Bring him in. Stay close enough. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Move, move, move. Okay, charge him. We just don't want to get too close to the other guys get involved. There we go. That's what we want to see. That's okay. This is okay so far. Take out their cav. Alright, we've got a single entity coming in here. The guns. Gotta get rid of those freaking guns. Last cast in there. Okay, pull them out. They're still charging over that way. That's fine. Okay, pull them out there. Okay. Oh, yeah. Alright, looks like we got rid of the Demigriff Knights, but there's still plenty of cavalry on the battlefield that need to be dealt with. Of course, Nakari's in pretty bad shape. That's it, keep luring them over here so they can just get shot. See if we can go for a pot shot with this guy. Let's go for one hit. No, the thing is, if you come up their ass, they just push him. Get out of the way, out of the way. Stop fighting those halberdiers. Die too quick. Okay, pin him down. Careful, careful, careful. Taking position. Moving now. Okay, good. I think that's their last single entity until their actual other armies show up. It would suck if Nakari is already defeated by them. We need to get rid of those Demogriff Knights, absolutely. Okay, move them up just a little bit more. Okay, pull them back. Battle's happening very quick. Move back, move back. Actually, get in there real quick. Kill that. 
pop this down on just uh actually I'll wait until some more units come in. Alright, good. The cavalry has been dealt with for the most part. Now cavalry's not taking too much damage. Alright, Nakara, you come over here. I want you to siphon this one's soul. Come on, break him. Break him. We've killed the enemy general now, haven't we? Yes. Okay, that's good. So they'll have a permanent minus 10 leadership penalty. Good. Now, there shouldn't be any missile units left on the battlefield now. This is exactly the sort of situation we need. No, 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 no. Not, not just yet. That's way too early. <laughs> Jump in the gun a bit there. Don't come too fast. Oh, my God. It's the joke. All right. Okay, get around this way here. Come in over here and use Tormentor Sword buys a little bit more time. Actually, while it's running away, this one here should go into melee with it as well to charge up the. Just wait to look for it to break. And you in. Get them around over here. Okay, it's broken. That's good. Alright, if it's broken, just let this one here run it down so it charges up this. And Nakari, you just need to be close by when it's wiped out. You don't actually need to wipe it out. Good, we'll charge up that ability on broken units. Good. Alright, this here is now super weak. We've done everything that we needed to do. We can now send a like a full-on charge on it and beat this side of the army. No problem. What's left in this one? Yeah, so if we crush this, these guys will come in first before any of them, and then we'll be on the other side over here, where our reinforcements are. So we'll take full control over this side, and then basically flip the uh, the map. Essentially, go, no, Nikari needs to be close by. All right, so we'll get control group six out now. We're about to do a massive charge in. Since we have missile superiority, let's use these guys here to thin out the herd a little bit. Specifically, not to wipe out units, but go for full strength units that are dangerous. I want to put this on a um, a great sword that's at full strength. Good, we've charged that a fair bit. I don't think she's going to get the full charge off it. We could if we just micro that a little bit better, but I can't be stuffed. Main thing here, just make sure that Nakari gets that healing. Good. Okay, another unit coming in of... That's just regular swords. Okay, have we got any great swords here with... Yeah, that one there. Pop that down on that high value. The gunners are still here. Okay. Actually, yeah, it makes sense to shoot that. And, like, get rid of it completely. Alright, Nakari, I don't think he's going to get much more healing. Maybe just one more unit to wipe out, and he'll be at maximum healed. Come on, break. Alright, this was a silly move. Okay, you can see what we're doing here. We're getting ready for a massive envelopment. And because all these units here are in bad shape, we should get a mass route very easily. I said aim for units that are in pretty good shape. All right, you guys just throw them in there, flank from this side. Focus more on over here first. Alright, charge in there. Get in over here. Your promotion. Onward. Okay, let's also bring in the chariots now. Don't forget about them. Right, you guys can stop shooting, because this is... We've, we've got this bit here. So we get to fight this with minimal casualties for this part, and also generate a lot of this stuff here. You should be coming in here and running down broken units so that you can charge your ability. Huge cluster over here. Crap. Let's get, we'll break it pretty easy. Pain is a gift. 
No, 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 don't fight that. That's not good. Now, one thing that we should also do before the battle is over is actually get these units here completely wiped out. Because they're not ours. Alright, we've got another single entity coming in. So, that needs to be dealt with. But he's just going to come straight over here and land, and then we'll just dogpile on him. You go and run that one down and charge up your abilities. Okay, said run circles around him. So good when he's that fast. So bloody good. Okay. What we're doing here, using our entire army just to fight little bits of them at a time, which is exactly what we want. This is working out really nicely at the moment. Away from the land and get fucked, you bitch. No, 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 what are you doing here? I told you to go over there. Can't get her out, she's just stuffing about. We've got missile units over here that will need to be dealt with. Sensation gives me a strength. Okay, that's, that's pretty damn blobbed up. We need to reform our lines a little bit. We'll get to that in just a moment. Okay, good, she got out of that. Alright, I need the chariots to go and take out these missile units. Okay, we've also got Empire Knights coming in. Oh no, big problem. Okay, those are... Those are a bit of an issue. Okay, we killed him. Alright, Cavalry, you need to get out of... Oh no, no, we didn't kill him. We didn't kill him. Oh, uh, he's immortal, so just get him off the battlefield. We'll kill him. It's the same thing, really. Get in over there. Okay. Okay, chariots not really faring too well there. Let's pull them out of that. Okay, send them in to go and assist. Ow, this guy here is not doing so well. Maybe I should get him out of there. We don't want him getting killed. Although he is immortal. Don't know if that guy's coming back. There was a bit of fight going on over here. I didn't even realize it. Not a big deal. Makari could use a little bit of backup. Okay, more reinforcements incoming. You move back. You turn around to shoot that if you can. Uh, at least they're not my units. See if we can pull this guy full of lead. Come on, quick. Get him. A couple more bullets. You got it. Good. Turn around and shoot them. Okay. That's Carl Franz's army dealt with. So that's two out of four of the armies completely wiped out. Good, she's got her thing charged. Alright, get it back over here. Good. Alright, you guys get set up over here, get ready for the next wave. Alright, I got no magic. Yeah, this force over here is pretty much all dealt with. Alright, where's this? I'm gonna put this now in control group seven. Now, control group seven is completely expendable. So these guys here have almost used up all their ammo. Go and use up the last little bit of it and then go seppuku, because you're not my unit, who cares? You're actually my enemy. Okay, you guys here, run them down. Okay, we need to get reorganized. These guys, and then them, just get set back up. Alright, save that summon for when they're bringing in missile units or artillery or something. Alright, I find that this is pretty good on Caribou Greatswords, that's good, because we're not going to be able to break them. So more single entities coming in. I think we just... Oh, hang on, we got incoming. We need to use this guy here just for the Tormentor Sword. He's already done a good amount of damage considering it is on normal unit scale. And they got some missile units coming in.
Because, yeah, if we get rid of these guys here, then they'll bring... It'll allow us to bring in some more reinforcements. Okay, she's really quite tired. Okay, just a few more shots and then I'll throw you in. To get killed. She needs more speed. Move it. This one's pretty quick. Alright, let's bring you two over here. Single entity versus single entity should be fine. Don't worry about using this. I've still got the Greater Gate of Slanesh as well. But we'll see about that. You guys can be on fire at will. Alright, just charge straight into that unit of crossbows. And uh, be done with you. Come on, keep up. Good. I don't think Nakari's been taking much damage lately. That's good. Come on, finish him off. Oh, all of our reinforcements are still going to come from here. Done. Okay, uh, you can go into control group two. And this one here is nowhere near as good. Are you on foot? No, you're on horseback. Okay. Yeah, that one's nowhere near as good. Kill that one. Okay, Nakari did get hit a little bit. By that guy. But he is a high level dude. Okay, one more lord to go, and I think we're finished with all of their lords. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, last single entity. Uh, you need to hang back a little bit. Alright, just let them roll over us here. Alright, how organized are we over here? Hmm. I was kind of hoping there'd be some missile units coming in here and I'd send my fast units around that way, but I don't think that's going to happen. Okay, balance of power just shifted. That's okay, we've still got a lot of reinforcements to come in. Using that on great swords, because yeah, that doesn't use up much of our power. This stuff here is okay, but dishing out damage is what we need to do. Yeah, this one here, it's a sprint to begin with, and then it's a marathon because yeah, it's a massive friggin' fight. What do you want? Yeah, most of our units are still in play. So with these ones here, just let them get run over, because yeah, not my troops. <laughs> let them die. So we got some Empire Knights here that need to be dealt with. It's okay if they hit this. No big deal at all. No, not you. Okay, let's pop down a summon. To hold them back just a little bit longer. So watch out for those guns if they decide to shoot at Nakari. They're going for this one. Move out of the way. Move, 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 move. We've only got a little bit of ammo left, so it's fine. Okay. Nakari needs to get out of there. Can we get out of there before you get killed by them? Almost used up all my ammo, but this is fine. Okay. Lure this one up this way. That is good. Oh, you're so close to, to getting wounded. I can't withdraw him from the battlefield and he can't rout. So you just need to be very careful with him. If he gets wounded, it's not that big of a deal. He needs another one of our reinforcements coming. That's it. Keep luring him up this way. Draw them back a little bit. Now I've still got this as well. No, they're shooting at Nakari. Can't have that. Get him out of there. There's no more healing Nakari can do. Alright, I need to use this. We're not done with Nakari yet. 
made their minds. The prince of pleasure's caress. Alright, now they're not going to... Cavort and Nakari help that out as well. Actually, you just go charge in there. I need these two to go harass the missile units. Don't let him rally. Hang on, hang on, hang on. We got incoming. Yeah, just let them sh Oh, there is still a single entity left. Okay, these guys, they're not done yet. Okay, reinforcements that come in from over there are going to be really vulnerable, so let's start moving around over that way. I'm going to get over here. Keep these here, but just here. Yeah, get the get the cavalry, the fast units over there. Good, looks like we killed him. Hang on, we got incoming over here. Hang on. We got demigriff knights there. That needs to be dealt with. Alright, we definitely don't want that fighting with them at all, but these ones here, that's fine. Yeah, we'll take some damage, but they're not going to trade well. If we have a look, yeah, they're not going to trade well, because we're going to break them real quick. Oh, there's more Demigriff Knights coming in that way. Okay, good, they're dealt with. Get back. Okay, it's Bounce Power's back in our favor. Keep swinging. Like a Slaneshi. Come on, let's move, move, move. Get away from that. It's not them that I'm worried about, it's the damn guns. Need some more reinforcements. Hope and kill my Empire forces. Let's move, move, move. That's it, move it. Okay, you can turn around now. Just need to be far enough away from them. Okay, control group six, keep making your way down that way. Watch out for them coming in. But those are oh, those are just regular demigraph knights. So they're, they're not exactly anti-infantry, but they're it'd be better if the infantry was fighting the anti-large ones, basically. It's a better trade-off. Keep softening them up. Alright, we need to get out of there. Alright, so Demonette came in, so that goes into control group 6. Send it around this way. Alright, what's this? War wagons, mortars. Okay, the infantry can't be going near that. But these guys can. What are these? Empire Knights? Okay, you just go hide in there for now. Still waiting on our other... There we go. Another one to come in. Go into Control Group 6. Actually, you guys here, Control Group 7, just because you're isolated. I'll merge you in when they get together. Alright, back to the other side of the battle. Back over here. Alright, War Wagons, Hellstorm Rocket Batteries. Alright, you... What's coming in from over here? Right, Nakari should be okay to handle this. Yeah, it should be fine. You two coming in as well to help. Not you, you're too badly damaged. God. On this unit scale, getting hit by a Hellstorm rocket battery really bloody slaps. Normally, don't really worry about it. That's silly, don't need that. No, 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 Need control group three to move it. Where's control group five? Yeah, bring them over here. All right, we got, oh, we're knocking off all the artillery here. Uh, hang on, guns, 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 guns. You gotta stop them. Right, like right now, don't worry about the mortars. Get rid of those guns, don't let them shoot. Okay, I need these. Control group seven over here. Same thing with control group three. What happened to control group four? Well, 
Which one was control group four again? Oh, that was the pistol ears. Yeah, they're gone. Good, we got a whole bunch of missile units coming in now. This is awesome. But Nakari just can't keep fighting like this. Those more is going to do more damage to their own units. Alright, we got Demigriff Knights coming in. But these are the non-anti-large variants, so our guys should have no problem dealing with them. Keep them pinned down here. Focus on those guns. Sorry about the mortar for it. Okay, these guys keep moving over this way. Alright, what are we popping down this on? More great swords? Yep. Oh man, Nakari's gonna have to stay out of it from here on out. Still a lot of reinforcements to come in. If we can get all of our troops over here ready for them, we'll absolutely crush them. I think we're actually getting fairly close to inflicting army losses. I may not even need to fight these guys. Come on, get everyone over here. Let's get these buckers off the battlefield. How are you going for summons? 30 more seconds in combat. Come on, get over here. Oh, no, no, Nikari. They've gotten their um, Empire of Knights in. Get out of there. Come on, get over here. Our troops can fight it easily enough, but Nakari, not so much. He's got to be very careful. A couple of hits and he's dead. Uh, I don't think you should be jumping in there. These guys here are going to take too long to get to us. Good, we got the Black Lions in melee, so that's not a good call for them. Not that they did that deliberately, we were just here ready for them, so that was really good timing on that. Yeah, we're going to have the chariots help out here. Don't need that. Come on, you guys, hurry up. Okay, we've got another summon ready, but I'll save that for these groups over here. Because our cavalry is doing a good job here. No need to interfere. Alright, that's the last of their cavalry. It's just artillery now. And I think we have army lost them. Yep, we have. Okay. Kill that. And we did it. Okay. Chariots. Run some of these guys down. Cavalry. Run some of these guys down. And it just goes to show you that you don't need lots of really good units if you're utilizing tactics. Which is what we did here. Hey, legend, it's not tactics, it's trees. Dude, we used our entire army. <laughs> just not all the time. Minimized losses. And fought the engagements only when it was favorable. So you go better. Yeah, Nakari and others. No single entities of ours got killed. The only units of ours that got wiped out were Marauders. That's it. Oh, and those guys that we seduced. But, you know, who cares about that? It's actually not quite over yet. Still got to deal with them. So, let's bring you up here and put that summon down to soften them up. Same thing with this. It's good for softening them. Because, yeah, it looks like they got a fair few Caribou great swords and they got the Sigma Sons, which that one's not too much of a concern. Don't use this. Because then they'll actually fight back and kill him. Which, that's not what we want. Okay, put them in control group 6 now. Just wait for all of our guys to get together before we make this final charge on them. Also, it's an uphill battle, which we don't want that. So we've got heaps of this as well, so if we just wait, we can really thin them out quite significantly. Also, the more of these guys that we run down, the more of these points we're going to get. I don't think we're going to be able to get to them in time. I'm trying. So let's get to the high ground here, so that this one can dish out as much damage as possible.
And with control group 6, start moving around them so that we can go up the hill. Definitely want to attack the Caraburg Greatswords because these are heavily armor piercing. Whereas the Sigma Sons just aren't really that much of a threat. I don't want to waste time on them. No, we're not going to get to them in time. Maybe these. But yeah, it's not going to beat it. It just it just softens them up a little bit. You know, doing 2,000 damage to them on this unit scale, that'll save quite a few of our guys here. But we, we've got this. No big deals. Get you out of there. That's it. Now we've got the high ground. Okay, bring these two over here to use their passives to debuff them. Doesn't matter, absolutely demolishing them anyway. And there we go. Close victory. I'm pretty happy with that. You know, we did not take much damage in that fight. And that's what it's all about. In fact, a lot of the casualties were their own units. But yeah, that kind of battle, you could significantly reduce the difficulty if you just break the battle down into way smaller engagements. Take out the tough stuff first, like... A lot of that effort was taking out Karl Franz relatively cheaply, and he did so much damage to Nakari. After we did that, the rest of it was just picking them apart until we are ready to just really smash them. And a good portion of their army we didn't even have to fight, because we had nice early army losses. Only one unit got wiped out, so that's good. But yeah, what a dog's breakfast there. <laughs> Holy crap. The garrison doesn't count. Yes. Maximum experience gained. I don't think you can get any more than 10,000 in a battle. I've never seen more than that. So, should we get you 1,400 devotees? Replenishment 15%. Favor. I reckon the devotees would be best. Replenishments should be fine. I mean, we smash them. Then They're not going to come back and fight you again. It's just so many devotees. Another good thing is that's going to add a lot of Slanesh corruption in that province so that your devotee army doesn't take attrition. Through the rest of this end turn. The end turns in the later stages of the campaign can last a little while. If there's any more battles, I'm not going to fight them. I'm buggered, I need to rest now. Because <laughs> yeah. the thing is, with normal unit scales, the battles kind of. I mean, that was a long battle, but the actual individual fights happen very quickly because their health is reduced, but their. Like for infantry, but their damage isn't re reduced, so they kill off each other's units really quickly. The individual units' damage, that is. So. You, know, you can blink and the fight's over. Which is why we did the best to just slow it down so that we could really hit them where it hurts. The Lord um, of both of those are kind of crap. So just go with the one that doesn't cost you anything. So yeah, this one ended up not taking any corruption. You had another army over here, but it wasn't in reinforcement range. But you wouldn't have been able to use it anyway because you had the garrison uh, acting as the fourth army. Actually, this one was the fourth army. But yeah, the Slanesh Corruption went straight up to 100, looking at your replenishment. You're okay, like losing that unit, it looks like it was a Regiment of Renown unit as well. Is that really that big of a deal? You just get them back, and there's another one over here if you really need it. And look at the damage done to them, they're all taking attrition, and they're replaced with really crappy lords. All of their heroes got wounded or killed in that, in that battle. So you're in a good position now to really push in against um Most against Reichland. They're totally screwed. If we have a look at their bounds of power, yeah, you I've just won you the whole war. <laughs> Cause if you didn't win that battle, all of these ones would have been wiped out. Yeah, you would have been struggling to recover from that. That was a very important fight. Anyway, that's the end of this one here guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned something. Appreciate you and we'll see you next time. Later guys.